action. I don't know. She's not breathing. She's not moving. I don't know. Just for you, okay? Matter of fact, get the hell out of my office because I'm in this mess because of you. Get out. Tell me you don't need that. Get the hell out. Just tell me you love me. Let me tell you something. I used you for sex. I used you like a whore. You were just so good for my ego, okay? I hope that makes sense now. Yeah. After everything I've done for you, after everything you promised and said, you call me a hoe. Don't you get it? So you told me a cat to love a wolf. So I can fall for you. You told me that so, you told me that I should leave my person so I can be at yours exclusively. And all this time you had no intention of being with me. Okay, Susie, I'm really sorry. Why would you do that? I'm really sorry. Please forgive me. Just tell me you're not going to leave me. There's something that I'll never do. Just get out. Get out. Just. Just. Get out. Look, I did it for us, okay? I did it so we can be together. What did you do? What did you do, Susie? I killed her. I killed her, okay? You killed Susie. Look, I didn't mean to, okay? I didn't mean to, but she, she just kept coming to my office and going on and on about you and Penny and your perfect marriage. To be honest, I sense she had some kind of attraction to you. So to me, it makes perfect sense. What's my magnetic attraction? Make perfect sense. But it, why did you even kill her? Okay. We became close, and she asked me to help her with a few documents, and I did. But she just kept asking questions about you and Penny. And honestly, I hated how she painted or painted this kind of sense when I knew she wasn't. Oh, so this is because I told you less about it. And you're a great liar, don't you think? Okay. Tell me. How do you kill someone that you just befriended? Woman, tell me because it doesn't frippin' make sense to me. Woman? I like that you sound so mean. Don't go there. Look, I had to come up with a plan. I had to come up with a story of an affair. That way Penny would leave you and we would be together. So you came up with the idea to kill her? I had to, okay? I wanted to spend every moment of my life with you. Let me tell you something. You are a cold-hearted murderer. Okay. Did this even happen before or after you sent those letters in my wife's name? Wife? Wife, Joss. I wanted that name. So I had to make sure that she made a peaceful end. <laughs> You're such a meditative murderer, Susan. Of course. That's what I do. I plan my life. I plan my work. I plan my moves, Joss. But you fucking tell me that you don't like her. Shut up. I don't get why. <laughs> I don't get why you're concerned with her. To be honest, it wasn't even that hard. Definitely. Definitely. I'm intelligent, you see. If you can't murder him as intelligent, be my guest. I do. Get the fuck out of my house. Hey, Cotton. 